One thing about being in the toy business, as long as I have, you start to think you've seen everything. But you know what? You'd be wrong. Hi, I'm Chris the Toy Guy from TTPM with one of the most outrageous, peculiar, and fun things we've seen yet. It's called the Bug Racer from Mattel, and it's completely twisted in the best way. This is the kind of toy that would have fascinated me as a kid, and I have to add, I was the only person at TTPM who was willing to review it because it involves playing with live crickets. Totally awesome. So, what this is, is a race car that's powered by crickets. Now, how could that be, you ask? Easy, I'll get to that in just a moment. Let's start out with the basics. This is a battery-operated car that takes four AA batteries. New batteries are highly recommended. Turn it on and put it through its paces, with or without insect friends, but of course, it's much more fun with. So, you get your crickets sold separately from the pet store. They're about a dime a piece. Put them in a secure container and remove the collection device from the back of the habitat. Catch the cricket in the collection device and place it back into the habitat. It opens and releases the cricket. By the way, the habitat has a magnifying panel so you can look at your cricket up close before you put them to work. Move the cricket into the control room at the front of the habitat and you're ready to go. Turn on the car and press the bug button by the power switch to move between modes. In the first mode, which you enter by pressing the bug button one time, motion sensors know where the cricket is and move the car in response as the cricket moves. The second, drag race mode, requires a second bug racer sold separately. In auto drive mode, you don't need the cricket and the car drives itself, redirecting if it bumps into things. And in light show mode, the car doesn't move. It just lights up as you watch your crickets move around or dance. One thing we did notice, and which wasn't completely clear in the directions, was that you have to pause and let the car cycle through the setup for each mode before pushing the bug button to advance to the next one. You can also adjust the volume for each mode by pressing and holding the bug button on the side. The habitat is designed so you can keep and feed your crickets in it, and you can open it easily to clean it out. You do want to be aware of the fact that the crickets are living things, so treat them carefully. They will live about a week in captivity. The instructions also include some care tips for your crickets. Now, we know there are lots of moms and dads who are going to be freaked out by this and not want to let crickets in the house. Well, that's okay. This works outside too. We were just completely excited by the creativity and off-the-wall fun this provides and the way it leverages kids' fascination with bugs in a really great vehicle. For more on this toy, including what it costs and where to buy, find us at TTPM and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great toy reviews every day.